Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of the Atari Texas YouTube channel. Well today we're going to be doing part two of my Sega Saturn collection. Uh, if you watched the first video that I put out a few days ago, I kind of showed the games that I have in my collection. And in part two today, we'll talk about the games that I want to add to my collection. There's about 20 titles that I want to add to my collection and once I think I've reached all 20 of those titles, I'll be done collecting for the Sega Saturn. Um, there's a couple reasons for that. Number one, I'm not a millionaire. Collecting for the Sega Saturn, if, if you know about it, is very expensive. Especially on eBay, the games are pretty high in price. And number two is I don't need every single game, you know, for a collection. You know, I just like playing the games that I like to play. And, uh, you know, I don't need to be a completionist for that set. Uh, especially when the prices are so high. And uh, did I mention number three? I'm not a millionaire. Once again, way too much money to get a full collection of Sega Saturn games. So what I'm going to do today is I'm going to talk about the top 20 games that I want to get. Like I said, once I get these 20 games, I'm done collecting for the Sega Saturn. What I did also is I looked on eBay, because unfortunately that's my primary source of finding these games. And what I did is I looked at completed auctions over the last 90 days to see what a complete inbox game sold for for the Sega Saturn. So here's my top 20 games that I want to get for the Sega Saturn. Number one, Burning Rangers. This is a big time game I've been wanting to get. Um, and this will be one I want to add to my collection. Right now this is going for about $290 complete in box. Once again, that's what they've been selling for on eBay over the last 90 days. That's the average price. Number two is of course a classic for the Sega um, Saturn and that's Nights into Dreams. And this has been running about $45 complete in box. Third game I want to get for the Sega Saturn is Worms. And this game has been running about $40 complete in box. Next game I want to get for the Saturn is Mega Man, Mega Man X4. I love the Mega Man series. This is a great adaptation to it. And this one's been running about $160 complete in box. Next is Duke Nukem 3D. Duke Nukem's always a classic. This one's been running about $45 complete in box. Next game I want to add to my Sega Saturn collection is Fighters Remix. And this one on eBay has been going for about $22. Tempest 2000 is the next game I want to get. Love the Tempest games. And this one goes for about $50 complete in box. Sonic R. Love my Sonic games you know, from Sega. And this one goes for $60 complete in box on eBay. Another game I want to add to my collection is Croc. And this one's been running for $25. Street Fighter Alpha 2 is another game I want to pick up for the Saturn. And this one's been running $40. The big one. You know, I have Panzer Dragoon 1 and 2. I want to get Saga. You know, this is the holy grail for Sega Saturn collecting. Uh, it's a fantastic RPG. I hear nothing but good stuff about it. And this one has been averaging $550 completing box. So this one may take a while to get to. Um, I'm hoping eventually prices will go down. I have no doubt this will probably be the last game of the 20 that I'll get uh, because of the price. So maybe the price by then will be down. Next game I want to get for my collection is Three Dirty Dwarves. <laughs> Try saying that several times. And that one's running for about $80 completing box. Next is Darius Gaiden, and that one's been running about $73. Mr. Bones. I've been wanting this game for quite a while. It just looks awesome. Uh, this one's been running for $37, complete in box. Galactic Attack. Love the space shooters. And this one's been running over the last 90 days on eBay. It's been averaging about $55, complete in box. Albert Odyssey, fantastic game. This one's been running $130, complete in box. This one, for some reason, I don't have yet, even though it's, it's priced pretty good, and that's Sega Rally Championship. 
And this one's been averaging $11 on eBay. Askel for the Sega Saturn. I've been wanting that one too. This one's been running an average of $58 completing box. And now I'm down to my last two games. One's Dark Savior. Love the looks of this game, everything about it I've seen, and it's been running about $45 completing box. And finally, the last game that I want to get for my Sega Saturn collection is Guardian Heroes. And this one's been running about $130, complete box on eBay. So those are the 20 games that I want to get for my collection. Like I said, I feel like once I get to those 20 games, I'm pretty much done collecting for the Sega Saturn. Uh, unless, you know, something else comes up. Maybe I, there's a hidden gem I don't know about that I'd like to check it out. So I know some of you are watching this are saying, hey, what about this game? And what about this game? How can you not have that in the list? And once again, it's personal preference. You know, um, these are... The type of games that I enjoy playing and, and that I want in my collection. Um, let me know uh, in the comments below what Sega Saturn games you would like to have in your collection. And maybe list me some hidden gems I may not know about. Uh, thanks so much again for watching. Uh, please subscribe and like the videos. And we will catch you next time. Bye-bye.